Hello there and thank you for watching. My name is Andrew Gray and I develop new products to try and fit in with how society is changing and the new demands that come upon certain industries. On this occasion I'm looking at forestry and a new form of tree tube or tree protector. Tree protectors are great if they produce the right microclimate for good healthy growth. And in this case, I produce a new sort of tree shelter which simply clips together and can then go round your, your, your plant and sapling and, and so forth. This is in 600 and also there are studs top and bottom to make 1.2 and here I'll show you in a moment, but we've, we've made one that uh, is, is double the width as a, as a plant shelter. So what we've created here is a modular system that can be made as a single sheet or multiple sheets to make large or fat shelters for shrubs, trees and, and, and other plants as you might need. This is a super efficient way of doing it. Um, this product can be made with to have lots of vents as you see um, and it, it, it's in clear but it could be in colour and then if you ever need to remove it or if the, the plant grows you simply pull it apart and then it, it can be reused again. The, uh, the thermoforming allows for lots of meshwork to make it really quite rigid and, and firm. Also Um, I've got some little slots so you, 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 you can slide um, a, a, a bamboo cane or other support uh, through and, and into the ground. So it's, it's usable in lots of different ways depending on circumstances. As I'll explain in, in, in other ways, I'm also using a silicon band, not rubber. Silicon will last for about 20 years uh, to go round the, 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 the stake um, as required. And this allows for a certain amount of wind rock. As you probably know, by the time the tree is two, it's, it's well rooted, it'll be stronger than the stake was in terms of support. What can happen in a more rigid tube is that the tree grows thinking it's in a very sheltered environment and puts all its effort into growing um, tall without putting the right amount of root down. Um, and then when a decent wind comes along after the tree is canopied, then it, um, it can easily blow over. So here we have uh, some shelters ready, they're in flat form and they're ready to be made up. So you just push them together like that. It's always easy when I'm not on camera. And I'll wager it takes just as long to pull one tube out of another in tube X as it does to make these out just about. And then of course when you want to undo them again, you just simply pull them apart. I 
hope it's clear that uh, in the example with the beech tree, uh, I've made a super wide version by you clipping two together. And of course you go, could go to three together to make it about 300 millimeter diameter. And in this example, I've, uh, and you can see the windrock. Uh, in this example, I've uh, put two, one on top of another uh, to create a tube that goes down.